Okay, I'm trying the Trader Joe's like spicy pizza and I made it at home. It basically has like this it it looks okay, like it looks like it's not cooking, but here's like a better like look at it. I don't know. It has like arugula, the bomba sauce, their garlic butter, bread, whatever, prosciutto, like mozzarella. I don't know, I'm trying to try it. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh, if you like spicy pizza, this is gonna be bomb. Like, oh, my nose is already running. I do wish I put the cheese in last though, like at the end, cause it melted off and like the juices made it a little watery, and not watery, runny, like and greasy, but pretty good. I would give it a nine out of 10. Okay, hi vlog, I'm back. I'm making dinner. I'm trying to get abs, but it's really hard because I like to eat sweet stuff, so I'm still eating sweets, but it's just like healthier. I get not even healthier. I'm just trying to be more conscious of what I'm eating. Um, oh. I'm making parmesan crusted zucchini and um, chicken. I'm broiling them. They're looking pretty good so far. And then I have chicken on my cast iron skillet. But I had this thought today, and I realized that I'm only 21, and that I have, like, the rest of my life ahead of me to start figuring things out. And sometimes I get anxiety about, like, what the future will look like in, like, two years, or what the future will look like in, like, three years. Or, like, will I ever move? Like, uh, I don't even want to say that, because I will. I will. Like, my dream job is to one day work in Austin, and, like, that would be my dream job. And that's, like, my goal within, like, the next two years, I hope. I don't know. I'm just like so easy. I, sometimes I just think about everything all at once and it really overwhelms me. And I, I hate not being able to like control what's going to happen. That's like the hardest thing for me. But, you know, today, yeah, the other, like the other day I had a conversation with someone and they saw me and they were like, oh my gosh, like I'm so happy for you. Like you said to sell me, like, look, I can't even talk. You said to tell me that you really wanted to do my job now. And... Like, now I'm getting my master's, and I'm going to be working full-time. And, like, while I was saying those things are really, like, exciting and happy, and, like, it's all good things. I'm also, like, what does that mean after the next few years? Like, what's the next plan? Like, I feel like I'm always, like, a step ahead instead of just, like, focusing on the now. And I think about that person, like, sitting in, like, my professor's chair, like, not knowing what I wanted to do. And, like, now I'm, like, in my big girl apartment in a different city. And, like, I can go to Trader Joe's every day. I don't know. These are just like random thoughts, and like, I don't know what the point of this is, but I'm only 21. I feel like I'm a one-year-old in adult life, and that was the summary of this. Thanks for listening if you did. Okay, here's my Trader Joe's haul for Sunday. Egg wraps, because I'm going to make feta egg wraps for breakfast. Um, Brussels sprouts, because I heard if you mash them down, they'll get really nice and crispy, and I wanted to do that. Brussels like shaved ones, because I'm going to make a salad. And I'm not a salad girl, but since summer's around the corner, I'm like, I need to eat some salads. And I got shrimp for my salad, because I found this TikTok recipe where you put, like, this spicy sauce on it, and you use broccoli and cut this up, and you mix it with the Brussels sprouts. But that's what I'm doing. Spicy Italian sausage, just because this is good. Um, French fries, because I've just been wanting French fries. Um... This meat, because it's good. I might eat that today, to be honest. <gasps> and then, I got this lemon mini sheet cake. And I love lemon, so I'm gonna fuck this up. Anyways. Um, I got bananas, because I'm gonna cut them up and make them frozen for protein smoothies. So I got this little protein. And I also got almonds for my salad. Um, cacao powder, because I heard that this is good. I'm going to do this with some almond butter. Some of this milk that I got, bananas. And yeah, I got maple pecan granola, which I'm kind of intrigued how this will taste. Mmm. That's really good. That's really good. Wow. This is, I think, my favorite granola now. Oh. 
If you like maple and pecan, mm, that's really good. Anywho, almond, cashew, and macadamia nut beverage. But I'm gonna use this for my protein smoothies. Um, olive oil, because I need more almond butter. And this Italian bomba hot pepper sauce for my salad. Um, yeah. Okay, everybody knows I love Trader Joe's and I got this, they have a, well not a new mini sheet cake, but I got the chocolate one because everyone said it was so good, so I'm going to try it. Um, and I ran five miles today, so I'm like, I don't even care how many calories is in this baby, but oh my gosh, let me open it. It's dark chocolate ganache. So, oh, it smells really rich. Should I get a, no, I'm going to Get a side piece. Okay. Here's the bite. Ugh, I wish I had a middle, but whatever. Wow. Oh. Oh. That's really good. 10 out of 10 if you really like chocolate, but if you don't, you will not like this, but this is so good to me. Okay, I just got back from the gym. I'm gonna have a poppy now. I've never had this flavor. It's strawberry lemon. Um, cheers. Boop. Smell test. Definitely smells like strawberry and lemon. Mmm. Actually, that's really good. If you like, like, sh literally strawberry lemonade, you will love this. This is really good. Cheers. <laughs> okay, welcome to my review of the ginger lime poppy. Um, I like Doc Pop, and I'm trying this one now. I think it's supposed to be like what Sprite or something. I don't know. Anyways, 20 calories, so five less calories than the other one. But if you like Moscow Mules, you'll definitely like this. But I think this would be good with a Diet Coke. I don't know why. I don't hate it. I think it's one of those things you have to mature and like. Because I used to not like Diet Coke, and then I started getting mature, and then I liked it. And I think this is like that. It does not taste like Sprite, though. That's my... I would give it a 7. Okay, day 2. My hair looks crazy, but I don't even care. I just got back from the pool. Doing poppy. I look so tan. This is Doc Pop flavor. It's 25 calories. Okay. Cheers. Boop. Ten out of ten. I think that one is the closest flavor that there is to tasting like the actual real Dr. Pepper. That's just as it gives me raspberry mixed with Dr. Pepper. I don't know why. Yeah, I could chop this. Yeah, really good. 